seats have arrived. So we're taking those old piece of crap seats out and putting these brand new ones. Those are going away. Those are going in. I got a pair. Fancy with a cup holder and a little junk box. Holes for draining. And overall weight is comparable to just the seat bottom with no back. Fancy. So, we're kind of getting those in. You might notice the seats are somewhat different width. I mean, this is for a much newer, different canoe. That's a homemade solution. I'm assuming to a broken or missing, whatever that's called. That is the brand new yoke just installed. And so, original seat mounting holes. The new seat doesn't quite fit there, but fits much better slightly forward. Oh, I zoomed out. So, kind of wedge that there. Ta da! So, this hole won't be used. This hole might line up. If there's a thin spot cut out here. So, I'll have to get the seat held in place and then drill down through the existing hole to try to catch it here and here. So I got those bolted in. I'll have to drill this hole, which is not going to line up with that hole. So I'll have to guesstimate where to drill and probably plastic weld those holes shut. That's weird. The face recognition on this camera just identified that hole as a face. It won't do it again. Hey, yeah, would you look at that? Hardware kit has things to just plug in the holes. I've got it set up so I should be able to use that front hole. So I measured back, set a ruler across, try to make sure this was parallel with the ruler. My hope is it's close enough. Yeah. There it is. And that should thread right into that hole. I'm going to do this without the camera. And this is why you don't normally see me filming. Uh, let me get that in there. Then a washer and a lock nut go on. Then I guess a little cap nut. Sure. Would you look at that? The canoe turned gray. Eats. No longer tacky. Well, depends on who you ask. It might be very tacky. So, painted both sides. Uh, 
uh, all the imperfections that were there that I didn't bother to sand out are still there. Fancy that. I might give this a quick sand after it cures up completely. Actually, I'm going to have to. Definitely have to. And I'm going to give it a second coat. But I want to let it cure for at least 24 hours before I do that. Uh, paint setup was really easy. I got this super cheap paint gun off of Amazon. Works pretty cool. Uh, light depression just gets the air going. Pulling it all the way back. Paints. So you can. vary the amount of paint that comes out. I think that's kind of neat. I got a water trap, water oil trap. Uh, that is very important. This had a lot of water in it. Back seats in. With its little straps. Front seat. Yoke. I uh, gotta do something about that. But for the most part, it's ready to go swimming. Chickens! Hey! Even oats. Duck, 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 duck. You're messy. Duck, 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 duck. Duck, duck, duck. Chased away by chickens. And they just keep multiplying. Why are you chickens? Yeah.